Hello and welcome to WordPress Tutorials. In today's video, I'll show you how to build a beautiful home page for your WooCommerce shop. So for example, I have about 55 products in my WooCommerce product section. But uh, if you see my home page, I do not have any contents yet. So I'll prepare a beautiful home page for my products to match with my uh, color and scheme. Okay, first of all, I'll uh, create a new page. Come to pages, click on add new. And please remember that I'll be using Elementor uh, editor for uh, building the page. Type name, home page, Elementor. And template will be Elementor full width, customizer, no sidebar. Disable title and publish. Now click on edit with Elementor. Now we will add a banner. Choose a full width and change it to full width. And click on stretch section because banner will be uh, completely full width okay add image drag the image layout and choose image Choose full image and click on update. Let's see how the image will look like. Okay, it's because of uh, the image size. Image is a little bit smaller, but if we zoom it on and open it on a smaller screen then it will look good but uh, we can add this image to the background as well just remove this and add it to background Okay, that's enough. Click on update. And let's see how it looks like. Okay, that's fine. Now we will add a product carousel. So for that, we will need a plugin. Come to your plugins, add new. Search for WooCommerce product carousel and press enter. Okay, we have uh, two plugins showing from Aztec. Uh, one for WooCommerce product carousel slider and one for slider as well as grid ultimate. So we will uh, need this one because we will also need grid for the home page. Click on install now. Activate the plugin. After activating the plugin, we will have a new menu on the left sidebar called WooCommerce products ultimate. Uh, as I showed you, I already have 55 products in my WooCommerce product section. So uh, setting up this plugin will be uh, easier. 
click on WooCommerce Products Ultimate and click on Add New. We will add a new slider grid, title it Home Page Popular or Featured Products. Click on Publish to add this grid. Okay, now uh, you have the short code and we can place it in the Elementor pages. But first, let's come to the general section and choose the layout from uh, grid to carousel. If it's already selected, then it's okay. Okay, display full title, yes or no. Uh, we will check in a while. Total products to display. We will display products, uh, only six products. Display header, this header position. All these settings can be changed. Just update it and let's use the short code and see the result. Copy the short code and come to the home page. Add a new row. And keep it boxed because on different screens it will uh, squeeze it to the uh, level where its uh, its limits are. So click on click here and add a short code. Paste that short code here. Click on apply and update the page. slider is here so we will give a title uh, so people will know what section is this come to the home page and add a heading title featured products and give it the right tag you want and choose the color you can choose the color code here but uh, I am just showing you so you can do it faster margin top and bottom and add some size to the heading on update and looks a little bit odd give some spacing below and above the title go to the settings page again here choose feature products because we labeled uh, that feature products and only those products will be shown if uh, some any products are tagged as featured so I do not have any feature product that is why I will leave it as latest product Featured ribbon, display sold out, product price. You can hide all these things from the slider. And we are done. Click on update. Now we will add a beautiful grid uh, below this to showcase our latest products. So come. and add a new grid we will call it home page products grid 
and click on publish first now after publishing the home page grid click on general setting and change from carousel to grid display full title yes or no it's because if your products have uh, longer titles then it will not fit in the grid so we will choose no and it will uh, shorten the title to uh, exactly the grid size products per page uh, we will show three columns uh, four columns and products will be eight eight products per page display headers no position no 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 latest products you can also uh, choose old older products or featured products but uh, as i mentioned earlier that i only have uh, latest products so let's update and come to short codes copy it and on the home page add a new row or just uh, duplicate this one and remove the title the the grid the products grid and add a new short code and paste that new short code here click on apply update okay four columns and eight total products you can also show paginations but uh, on home page we normally do not show paginations so feature products to change it here to any other latest products or something like that so here is the grid layout with uh, add to cart button on the top of each products but uh, you can also choose any other format come to grid select home page uh, grid product and in grid setting choose theme 2 and click on update refresh the page and it is theme 2 with add to cart button below the product in the first layout uh, add to cart button was um, above this grid as you can see just like this because this page is not refreshed yet okay in the theme 3 come to grid setting the theme 3 will be uh, hover effect add to cart on hover let's refresh the page and as you can see add to cart is on uh, hover now and not below anymore so uh, whichever grid you want you can uh, choose that one so okay we will uh, also add some more padding to the slider to the banner so it looks more professional it's 250 from top 250 from bottom and updated okay now it somehow looks better than that so this is the home page right now and, uh, in the next step we can uh, add a contact form or a call to action button but uh, this is uh, so far the main requirement of our home page uh, i hope you learned something from this video please give this video a thumbs up if you liked it and please subscribe to our channel so you won't miss our future updates thank you